Leave it to Google Earth to make a fascinating find in the Chinese desert. The satellites captured these images, grid-like patterns in remote parts of China. Well, it's unclear just who made the lines or why, but there is speculation that they could be part of some sort of military training area. One tech website reports that if you look very closely, you can see destroyed buildings and even aircraft within the patterns. Well, let's bring in out Jenny Harrison to get her take on this mystery maze. Jen, what do you make of it? Well, I'll tell you what, I mean, the conspiracy theorists out that Anna are just having an absolute blast with this, as you might imagine. Uh, let's have a little closer look. I can actually show you where these areas are sort of properly in relation to the country. So here's China, of course, massive country. We're up here, the northwest, very close to the border with Mongolia, as Anna said, out in the desert. This, this is one of the first ones. Now, what is incredible about it, as we said, is that uh, we are looking at an area that's about 160 kilometers away uh, from the, the space program, China's space program, where they have the launch pad, where they do all their work. Now, this image here was actually back in 2005. So all this central area that you've just seen, that, as you can see, is actually not in place. So whatever it is, it has taken, it would seem, several years to create it. Then when you zoom in closer, you see this. Now these are, what are they? We don't know. We can't really tell. Are they roads? Is it something on top of the ground? Is it something that's being dug down below? Uh, maybe it's just limestone, some sort of chalk that has been literally laid down. And then when you head just to just not far at all away from there. You can see this is what uh, we're talking about when we say Google Earth can also spot, you know, those really close-up images of uh, uh, trucks and things on the ground. Then, to the west of all this, here's another much bigger grid, it would appear to be. But you'll notice how all the lines are looking very dusty, very dirty. Uh, so it would appear from this that this is something that was created before the other. So it's several years old. If you carve limestone, for example, you know, in the side of uh, a hill that is made of limestone, of course, over the years it does weather, and that's what's happened there. Here's another interesting one, Anna. Look at this. I mean, what does this look like to you? Is it a road? Is it a runway? Uh, I mean, this is what is so fascinating. And uh, such an array, I think, of different shapes and symbols. And then this is the other one. And you can see here these white uh, planes showing very clearly. And then, of course, you zoom out and you're left with this with this spiral. Um, so, Anna, I'll be honest, I'm no clearer to knowing what this is, having looked at this all day long, zoomed in on Google Earth, um, you know, to what you can see and everybody else out there. What do, what do you think all this might mean? I'm not sure. Do you think our friends from outer space have uh, paid us a visit? <laughs> you know, I have to say, uh, I don't. I know, I'm going to say that quite categorically. <laughs> I mean, I think there are probably more hospitable places Come in on, the Jen. world. You've got to be, uh, <laughs> I mean, of all the places to head to, the, the deserts in northwest China. No, I refuse to, Anna. I refuse to. I'm not one of these conspiracy theorists. I don't know what it is. It's interesting. <laughs> it's fascinating. But it's very private up there. It's very, very quiet. I mean, you mentioned it's on the, uh, on the border with Mongolia. Yeah. It is desolate. Yeah. Oh. Well, in that part of the world. So who tell knows? You what? Good, good hideout? Uh, well, you know, extraterrestrial friends. Somebody needs to go and have a little bit of a look, don't they? But that's never going to happen. I think Google they Earth do. is to getting closer. They do. I, I want to carry on looking. Uh, Jen, that is your assignment. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to fly you there. You'll have to give us live reports.